Hey guys, just want to share a quick video on how to assemble your uh, Z assembly for your VisiBot. Um, it was a bit hard in the past, so we designed a small tool to make this a whole lot easier and make this small little tutorial uh, to explain uh, the best way to align this. Oh well, maybe not. Maybe it's not the best way, but anyway, this is how I did it, and it seems super perfect. So if you follow this exactly, uh, you'll be good. First step is assemble your bed assembly, the extrusion based bed. Um, this needs to be super straight, so all the corners need to be 90 degrees. It needs to be straight to each other. Um, I just laid the extrusions on a really thick mirror. Um, then I assembled the entire thing, including these parts, the LMU holders. Uh, that's very important to have them straight on. Then what you're gonna wanna do is assemble everything, but keep the brackets loose to the extrusion so you can still shift them around a bit um, you're gonna take the printed tool from the github you can find those uh, in 8 10 and 12 millimeter versions depending on which rod you're using you're gonna bolt these two of them one in the bottom one at the top then you're gonna place a z uh, rod um, and push it against uh, the brackets and tighten the upper and the lower one for one corner. You're going to repeat this for the other side. Then what you're going to want to do is get your bed totally to the top or bottom. Doesn't matter which you do first, but I did the top first. Push it to the top and then you're going to tighten that bracket and that bracket. After you've done that, do the same for the bottom. Or the top if you started at the bottom of course no problem there um, and then it should be nice and parallel it may be a binding a bit um, but we're gonna solve that uh, a, a little later uh, next up is connecting your lead screws so you're gonna want to drop in your lead screws and make sure that is exactly in the middle of these two parts of the z roll holders same goes for this you can measure this by uh, this distance and, and di this distance with calipers should be pretty much the same and it shouldn't wobble a whole lot uh, Make sure to measure this when it's at the top uh, Not at the bottom because at the top uh, there's some play in those nuts So it can shift a bit it makes measuring a bit hard um, Yeah, when you finish that um, you want what you want to do is place your bed entirely to the top and loosen the LMU holders a little uh, just finger loose give everything a little shake so it can set into its its, its place it's, uh, it's like natural place and then tighten everything back up so it's very nicely aligned with each other even uh, this will take up some small minor misalignments so it will be very smooth um, yeah that's pretty much it then it should be good you should still check whether your Z and stop triggers at the right position and stuff but should be pretty straightforward um, one little bonus I did for the X gantry um, I just took these uh, things uh, you use to uh, align your uh, linear rails to your extrusions um, I placed them on can do it now right now because I've got the belts on but you, you'll get the idea what I did is measure this relative to this extrusion uh, same goes for the other side and I, then you push your egg gantry all the way to it make sure these are really tight measure again and then tighten up those end, uh, bolts so um, you can check your alignment by measuring the distance between um, your linear rail and the front extrusion left and right should be exactly the same and if not you uh, should redo it again make sure it uh, you, you, you're being meticulous about it um, so pretty much that's it so guys if you have any more questions you should definitely check out uh, our discord channel and um, there are a lot of cool people uh, on there answering your questions showing off prints showing off their builds um, also go check out the github um, weekly we add more STLs, assemblies tutorials stuff like this um, also you should definitely check out uh, Vess's youtube channel he's an awesome guy he started all of this we love you man you're awesome.